Because shocked tonight at the Terre Haute City Council meeting, it was revealed that county officials will ask the city council to rezone the Prairieton Road location for a new jail. It means that the city will now determine how that property will be used. Taylor Williams was at the meeting and has a breakdown of what this all means. Taylor. Mike, the news came as a surprise to many in the audience, including members of Riverscape. It's a group that wants to turn the old industrial paper plant into an outdoor destination. Yes. Councilperson Morris. No. Vigo County officials now want the city council to determine the fate of the proposed jail site on Prairieton Road. The news was presented to the council before they were to vote on a resolution that the city has the power to rezone the property. That resolution passed by a 7 to 2 vote. That's what we felt uh, was necessary. It's just the uh, legal way it should happen. The news also shocked members of Riverscape. It's a group that has plans to develop the property into an outdoor destination. They had planned to present their ideas to the council, but I've now decided to wait until the city and the county meet. What we have represents the opportunity that will be lost if we put a jail on the international paper property. So I want to represent that at the time they vote, and I don't want to get back up as a rerun in a month. Members of Riverscape did provide WTWO with a summary of their plans for the property. The project would cover more than 110 acres and would include green space, an amphitheater, a minor league baseball stadium, and more. Members say their plans have been in the works for a dozen years. There's so much more that can be done with that property. To improve our quality of place, to bring to bring people here, uh, to be the the recreational magnet uh, that it can be. At least one woman was impressed by Riverscape's ideas. People are beginning to have a sense of pride about their city. For the first time in my life, there has been a vision that I think is so important to this city, and that is to bring us back to the river. So what's next? Well, city and county officials will meet during the December 6th city council meeting, and it is possible that county officials will be back to square one in determining the new location for the jail.